Hey guys, what's up? Happy Monday. Thank you so much for tuning in as always. Sorry, it's a little like, I don't know, I have shuddery. I have my twinkly lights on and they just kind of give off this weird, I don't know, effect. I'm not going to turn them off. I refuse because I'm going to turn off this nasty light right after I make this video. Um, sad news, not the saddest. My little this is, this looks weird. Okay, this looks strange. But this goes on the back of my phone and you, you hold it, you know, with your fingers and it makes it super easy to film and to pretty much just carry around and use so you're not holding the sides of your phone. It's, it's great. It broke today. I dropped it. It lasted me for quite some time, so um, very sad about that. But in good news and other news, I had a tremendous training day today. It snowed so much that we had to shovel this morning. Well, I did not have to. I went out there with my boots on and I was ready to shovel. I was ready to do my time, do my diligence. I know how it is. And she flew because I was sick. He didn't really know what was going on. She flew 21. So he was like, stay inside. Uh, and there was pretty much no arguing with him. But I was like, I'm not going to complain about that. But while they were shoveling, I snuck into the training hall and did my own stuff, which you know is hard to, so fucking hard to motivate yourself. So I forced Eric, who is here from Denmark, to do some stuff with me to help me get back into it and everything. And uh, he's a super cool dude, super cool dude. Um, but I will say he has a very strong BO to him that uh, I was aware of. Um, but working right next to him, it's um, pretty uh, pretty difficult. I don't know if you you know you've been around people who have very strong smells. His room also smells like that, and I just couldn't. I mean, it was actually hard for me to focus, and it was I wasn't gonna fake it, so I had to speak up. I had to say something. Um, I didn't really know the best way to approach it, so I was just like, "Damn, boy, you got so strong, bo. You ever notice?" And um, he was like, no, I know, I know, I know. And I knew he was going to say that because I've been around people who have very intense smells and they're, they're completely unawares. And it's super awkward to bring it up because you don't want to be like, hey, you smell, uh, I don't know what's going on, but check your shit out, wear more deodorant or take more showers. Who knows? Who knows or washes clothes more? But like, he does take showers and he does wash his clothes, so I'm not really sure why his smell is so intense but uh yeah we we worked out we did our thing and um i was very thankful I lifted a ton of weights and i know i'm gonna be feeling it tomorrow i'm so excited i really hope so i'm gonna do the same thing tomorrow um, because of this disease it's not a disease this infection that i had is going the fuck away i'm sure it's probably still in me i'm sure that i'm still taking a ton of medicine for it but I'm not having any symptoms, so amazing, thank God. Um, yeah, and I just wanna work hard this week. <sighs> and then the afternoon training was lovely and went outside in the cold and that was nice. And then I went to night training and I did my abs and just slowly easing myself back into the groove of things because your girl is, uh, it's not easy to keep up with the consistency. Everybody always says it, but damn, it is really tough mentally to keep motivating yourself and keep pushing yourself and finding the point, like why you're doing it and what's the purpose. And really it's just coming down to super basic stuff is that I feel better when I am pushing myself, when I feel healthy, when I feel strong, I feel better, I feel happier. I feel like I can breathe easier, I can move through life lighter, so many things. Um, and I just like felt that today working out, it was a nice reminder. So I, I think that's why I've been so sad because I haven't been um, going as crazy as I used to. And it makes me sad, but ease my way back into it. I am going to have some of these probiotic healthy, supposedly healthy, as healthy as I, I can get, uh, yeah, some more of these, I had two yesterday, I'm gonna have a couple of my little nightcap for tonight, 
and I will check you tomorrow. Wish me another great training day. I'm gonna focus on being light tomorrow. Lots of bouncing, lots of jumping. I'm gonna do a lot of jump rope, do that in the morning, um, and work on my legs tomorrow so I can be light on my, light on my feet. It's like, wow, I wish I was 16. I would just be like bounding through life, bounding. I have to, my whole body just goes <sighs> Started from the bottom. Seriously, that's what it feels like. When are we gonna get here? I'm still at the bottom. When is it gonna be here? Someone tell me, how long does it take? Start from the bottom and get to here. Does anyone know? Is anyone there? Is anyone here? Hello? Are you here? Hello? Barbara? Are you here? Hello? Mom? Alright guys, I'm gonna go. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Say chin.